Hello, good uh, morning everybody. Um, we got a new game. I'm gonna give this shit another try. Um, I tested this game out for streaming like a few weeks ago and um, trying to play it keyboard and mouse and camera shit its pants and all that kind of stuff. Uh, but I tested it again with controller and it was a lot better, so we're gonna give it another go. Um, I need something kind of lighthearted to go against Dark Souls because it is like, sucking my soul out, you know, so. Any event, let's get cracking. Um, this game is the opposite of Dark Souls. Not in terms of difficulty, I think some of it's quite hard, but I um, guess we'll find out, huh? We'll start a new game. Oh, yeah. Uh, definitely normal. I am a bitch. Fast, please. We can play with that later. We'll leave it at default. Yes, subtitles. Thank you. Um, can I change the language? Give me the option before I turn on the game. Maybe it won't give me the option mid-game. That'd be annoying. I would not like that. We like the background music. It is already kind of loud, though. I'll turn that down a little. Because those high eyes can get pretty loud. Um, why do I have that off? This thing has vibrate, I think. Okay, we're good. Okay. The Legend of the Shepherds. In a bygone age of myths, when darkness threatened to enshroud the world, it was they who reclaimed light from nothingness. Over and over, as the world plunged into chaos, the legend would come to people's lips, and they would pray for salvation. The legend would come to and their lo, lips. Each time, a shepherd would appear to vanquish the darkness once more. But with peace returned, it was never long before the shepherds would vanish. As for where they had gone, no one can truly say. And, as with all things, eventually they faded into legend. Do all things really fade into legend? Now, once again, 
the world faced the threat of the darkness. Yeesh. Where's my goddamn gun? <sighs> and the people began to speak of the shepherds once more. Oh yeah, this guy's all about it. Alas, no shepherd came forth to guide his people to peace. Very pretty. Um, hmm. that all makes sense. Ooh. Dark Souls. Oh, come on, man. Dark Souls would let me fall off the ledge. See you. I knew it. A hero brandishing the sacred blade. This mural is a depiction of the shepherd. <laughs> you dumbass. About time I found it. Nothing on my end, Sore. Miklio. Looks like he beat me this time. This proves the Shepherds have been around since even before the era of Asgard. I knew it! Let's not jump to conclusions just yet. We still don't have definitive proof that this ruin itself is pre-Asgard. Asgard? What it could be an imitation of mythology Seriously? are we working? You really with? think they'd make a fake ruin of this scale? Get real. Hey, Skullqueed. Morning. This doesn't bode well. Wait. Isn't that... I think our ruin adventure is over for today. What, are you afraid to get wet? The evening, that's Come right. On. That's great. Cool. Hope you had a good day today. Did... Mine's just beginning. Uh. Yeah! That was too close. Could I get a little help, please? Don't be a dick about it, man. I just saved you. Surging currents! Twin flow! <laughs> Saray. That didn't go quite how I planned it, but not too shabby, am I right? I guess. Guess this makes us even. 
Man, I should change to Japanese. This dialogue is so stilted. Unbelievable. It's not great. Who knew there'd be ruins underground? Oh, good thing we fell down here. I'm only assuming it's better in Japanese. Right. It could be dead wrong. Hey, let's try and find a way out of here. Hmm? Oh, yeah. I expect there to be like a Final Fantasy X moment where they just go, ha 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 Better leave the investigating for another time. We need to find a way out of here. Nuclear, oh, come on, man. Okay, but seriously, how does my DLC work? Some fashion. Oh. Save over my test runs here. Should have deleted those so I can at least pretend like this is my first time ever seeing this shit. But I guess the cat's out of the bag. Drop. It's been nothing but heights all day. But I had an awesome bar relief to distract me. Yeah, I bet you did. I did, you hmm? saw it. It looks like someone's lying there. Hey, Miklio? Hmm? It's... it's a human. It can't be. Stop. <laughs> we shouldn't involve ourselves with their kind. She's still alive. We can't just leave her there. Fine. I'll give what help I can. Let's take a look around the area first. Okay. Your little twin cape is going to get caught in the jet engine or something, pal. I'm telling you. Yeah, my sword's all sticky. Cobwebs everywhere. I bet no one has set foot in here for some time. Uh oh. What's wrong? mode is set to semi-auto, currently is, you will run towards the target until you are close enough to attack. You can, create, can then create up to a 4-hit combo with additional presses and B. It's possible to acquire new arts by level now. Well, that was easy. Wait, Game 1. Hold on. It can't be... A Hellion? A Hellion? For real? I've never seen one in person before. What, what could a monster like a Hellion be doing in a place like this? It's getting away! Wait, don't you remember what Gramps told us? Huh? This dialogue sucks so bad. Hellions? <laughs> yep, Hellions. Horrible monsters that are created by the malevolence. The skit dialogue rocks. They can only be defeated by the power they, of purification, which not but a Mid -game chosen didn't time can it use. So it's like choppy choppy, all stilted. It's bad. So if you ever cross paths with a Hellion, just run as fast as you can. Okay, you old stoner. 
Remember you two. Common folks like us don't stand a chance against those fiends. I'm sorry your eyes were eyebrowed shut. That's a terrible thing. Got it? Grandpa. We can't beat a Hellion without the power of purification. And we should just be glad we escaped it. And anyway, we have bigger problems. Hmm? We have to hurry and save that girl. Before something worse finds her. In areas where Hellions roam, making contact with an enemy will launch a battle. By swinging your sword using X or using other map actions, you can begin the battle with an advantage. Sorry, I got the hiccups. I ate a banana. You know how it goes. You can find treasure chests and dungeons in the field, as well as consumables. Chests can contain equipable items. These may often have the same name, but they perform differently depending on the attached skill. You can check any items in the equipment. Menu. I will ask, this game spawned a whole new fetish? Which fetish is that? Because... Which fetish is that? Because there's a lot. We're talking anime fetishes? Wow, that's a broad spectrum. Uh, Ares discovered among ruins, said to endow the wearer with an enhanced understanding of nature. I'm going to screw that up a lot. Customize your equipment and titles. Fusion. Oh. Oh. Okay. Um. Oh. Thanks to... Okay. Oh, Alright. Fusion, huh? And not Dragon Ball Z? Huh. Alright. Equipping titles can allow you to learn new arts or obtain other special bonus effects, depending on your proficiency. With that title, proficiency is increased when you level up. Each piece of equipment has four skill slots, into which can skills can be attached. The skills in the first slot is preset for each item. The skills, if any, and the other three slots are determined when you acquire the item. Uh, I should just I should remember this stuff instead of just saying it out loud. Uh, you can check with which skills you have equipped by opening the skill sheet with R2. There are two major types of skills outlined in the skill sheet. The basic skills attached to your equipment skill slots and bonus skills, activated by certain arrangements of basic skills. There are three methods of activating bonus skills. Jeez. Systems in this game are nuts. They are absurdly deep. Fun. <coughs> Stack. Created by equipping multiple copies of the same basic skill. The number indicates how many of that skill is equipped. Equip two or more to activate a bonus skill. Elemental Union. Created by equipping skills directly adjacent to each other on the left or right. Line up two or more to activate a bonus skill. Group Union. Created by equipping a vertical column of skills in one group. Line up all five in a group to activate a bonus skill. That sounds like probably the moda, most badass one that there can be. A line of five. It's perfectly fine to select equipment based on its parameters, but by combining different skills you may discover surprisingly effective interactions. Take a little time to try out different types of skills and find the ones best suited to play to your playstyle. Sounds like fun. I'm kind of into it. It may look a bit daunting, but after a few battles, I shouldn't hope so. This makes sense. This makes perfect sense. So I think this represents gear I have, but not equipped to him especially. Yeah. So this has that. Yeah, that makes perfect sense. Cool. Hi Shin, not what I expected. Yes, well, me neither. I tested it out yesterday, I played it for a little while, didn't get too deep into it, and um, I enjoyed it quite a bit. Is that a monolith? Searching for monoliths scattered throughout dungeons and in fields are stone monuments or monoliths written by persons unknown that detail lost battle techniques. After finding one, you can check its teachings at any time in the battle section of the system book. For each one you find, you will gain AP, which is necessary for setting battle actions. When you find one, press A to investigate it further. Blindsided everyone with its systems. It appears to be wisdom pertaining to battles written in an ancient time. As you fight more battles, you will level up and acquire new martial arts. <laughs> 
Um, charging and piercing arts is up and down. Mobile and area of effect arts. Cool. That makes perfect sense. Switch them up as needed depending on how the battle is going. You can view available attacks in the arts menu. Great. You just want to hit X and have waifus. Yeah, that's what I would. That's it. Thank you. That's the system. That's what I came here to do. Is this my first Tales game? I have. Um, there was one for 360. I think it was um, Vesperia that I played. Oh uh, god, maybe 20 hours into and eventually quit. Oh yeah. Focus, guys. Ready? Let's get him. How's this? I've never beaten Tales. Ready? Sweet dreams. Okay, this is block. I don't remember how to use it. Yeah, so I'm tracing my SC. Ah, lose instead of blocked. You okay, okay. Mikleo? Vesperia regarded as one of the best. I was enjoying it quite a bit. Um, I forget why I quit. I think just a new shiny game came along. I played that instead. Uh, Spirit Chain. Spirit Chain is the energy needed to create combos in battle. The maximum SC you can have at any one time is 100. Actions such, such as martial arts will consume your SC, and having low SC makes you vulnerable. SC can be replenished by being idle, guarding, or moving around. Keep an eye on it and make sure it doesn't drop to zero. The first chapter is always a lie. Always. Cool. I like lies. What does that mean, a lie? Like it didn't happen? Uh, medicinal gel heals one ally's HP by 30%. While moving or in battle. Uh, anything to say, Mikleo? That was a Hellion. And yeah, I doubt it's the only one. We need to get out of here as quietly and quickly as we can. Tales of Zillia had you travel to the god, but then it turns out she did not exist. For the follow, Taco six six seven. You're no good. Appreciate the follow. Um, how many of these games are there? I feel like there's many, many that I have never heard of because there's three on Steam. And this area was for three sixty. Wait, hold on. That human probably got caught up in all the lightning, just like we did. More like the other way around. We have her to thank for all that crash, boom, bang. That lightning. That was Gramps, Many. wasn't it? Yeah. It's a warning to invaders. Not one more step. <sighs> Sorry, Gramps. I can't just leave someone who needs help. Huh. This is turning into an eventful day for once. That was a cool monolith. Cool We've monolith. Quite yeah. a bounty of discoveries today. If I'm not mistaken. Okay, one free follow for playing Dale's game. Thank you, Taco. Ruins. Appreciate it. Yeah. <laughs> It's from a completely different age. It read like advice of some sort. Most likely it's a guidepost left by previous visitors to aid fellow travelers. So we're not the only ones who go around investigating These ruins. are good. Humans have terms for them. Things like adventurer or explorer. Explorers. These skits are really, really good. The dialogue in game is really, really bad. Because it's so stilted, it's so Final Fantasy X. But the skits are great. Anyway, um, I just wish it was more like that throughout the entire game. There we go, it's like my test runs never existed. Never happened. Now we can all pretend this is new to me. Shall we begin? Defend against enemy attacks with attacks. I know, man. Ah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna attack Scott. Right yeah. Uh, how do I change bros here? There we go. You gonna participate, Mikleo, or what's the deal? Just managed to fend them off. Tales of Symphonia. Um, I believe I have that on Steam as well. I have Symphonia. Um, 
Hysteria and um, Burst Area. There's no super bad laughing scene. I feel like that's going to come, Shin. I feel like it's happening. Oh, by the way, Shin, uh, super embarrassed. It turns out there's an NPC in Dark Souls in Blight Town named Solidus that I missed. And I was pretty frustrated that he missed that. Uh, so I felt bad about that. Hit points. Taking damage from enemies reduces your HP. HP is depleted to zero. The character is KO'd, and when all companions are KO'd, battle ends in defeat. Cool, man. Cool. I can sense the ancient tongue. We're near one. It appears to be wisdom pertaining to battles written in an ancient tongue. Guarding. If the enemy guards against your action, SC recovery rate is halved until your next move. If an enemy successfully blocks your first attack, it's likely to keep blocking any further ones. Just take care not to just combo indiscriminately. Note that this rule applies to enemies as well. So if your goal is to deplete their SC, guarding is a smart move. Thank you. Kind of fitting that he's a Blight Town. That's exactly right. Strike. It's over. I'm gonna try this free run gimmick. Okay, to that works. Now. Oh, he does shit? No, he never talks. Most of the NPCs never talk. Hmm. notifications on the screen soon. Okay. Um, we're pals. Alright, I win. I defeat the spider. I guess I win. <laughs> um, received ancient circlet. Circlet is unearthed from ancient ruins. Increases casting speed of seraphic arts as well as their strength. Yeah, I mean, I just did. There he is. Hey, buddy. Ready, Nicleo! Defensive maneuvers! Okay. Except with the. Yeah. Uh, I'm not doing it. Oh, there we go. Be gone! Ready? It's over! Strike! It's over! Ready? Strike! It's over! I like Ready? it. No escape! Like it. Smite the malevolence! It won't Get here! It won't lose! Let's get him! What's wrong with the AI? I don't know. Just running away from it. Something's not right? Okay. Aliens. I win. I, I hacked the game somehow. Um, learned a new art. And... Okay, great. I haven't... I didn't change any of the uh, enemy settings. It should all be on normal. Uh, let's check out our new shit. Parts. Nicleo. Lunar Strain. Charges in with a spinning staff attack. Rending Torrent. All your move names are names for, for um, ejaculation, bro. These are all for ejaculation. Pretty much every one of them. Uh, maybe not that one. That's just bonus. Most of them are ejaculation, though. Yeah. Um, so... I guess they're all automatically equipped. Can I just unequip some? That I don't like. Um. Hmm. Automatic. Not a huge fan of that. 
Twin Flow Hall. Well, maybe not that one. Um, hmm. Is that what you ejaculated P exactly? Uh, yeah. The, the valve doesn't work right. Uh, so what did I learn? Battle actions. You view the criteria for acquiring an unlearned battle action by highlighting that action in the menu with the cursor. Battle actions marked as auto indicate that the action is performed automatically. This may be useful for players new to the battle system who are still figuring out the rules. Once you get the hang of combat, try removing these actions and using your AP for other battle actions. Uh, if able, the controlled character will guard up to five times automatically. That sounds good. These all sound good. Um, snipe charge. Defend for one or more seconds and the effective potential of your next attack doubles. If I quit, quit, oh no, okay. I don't want to do it. Hmm. Yeah, I'm absolutely going to have that. Oh, okay, I can only have... Well, that's fine. I'll just use this. Then. Just fine. Oh, did these apply? Oh, these are only controlled characters, right? Yeah. Oh, okay. That makes sense, Taco. Yeah, I think that's probably what we're going for with that one. But anyway, Dickley out here has some pretty good moves when it comes to boners. Generally, you want offense until your HP drops below 50%. Okay. Oops, I went backwards entirely. Then, yes, alright. Where the fuck am I going? Did I go backwards again? Nope. What's this? Whoa! What the. I'll be taking this. If you get too hung up on fiddling with it, we'll never get out of here. What does that mean? What is I'll it? I'll give it back once we return safely. Uh, <laughs> Don't touch if you my say shit, so. Diglio. You're gonna earn yourself a nickname for 100 hours of this playthrough, pal. So close, but it's still so far. Think we could jump? Only one way to find out. Appears to be wisdom pertaining to battles written in an ancient time. Uh, the lower your SC, the higher the damage you inflict, but this is generally not recommended. SC recovery rate is proportionate to your SC level. Uh, spirit chain. I gotta remember that. SC means spirit chain. Um, solo spirit chain also means slower recovery. Fighting while maintaining a high spirit chain level is more effective than attacking until it completely runs out. Of course, if there are times when going all out is worth it, like when enemies are stunned, What's important is to balance your approach. Oh, my AP just went up, so I can probably get another ability. Uh, what else can we do up here? There's so many things we haven't explored yet. I know, dude, we did that. Difficulty, just normal. Just normal. Um, titles. You can think of titles as unique equipable items that enhance character stats when wearing them. By completing events and leveling up with a particular title equipped, its proficiency will go up, allowing you to learn new skills. Is that so? Sword Harrier. Um, I get Tiger Blade. I also get Tiger Blade, but that enhances focus. That's better for attack. Stun rate plus 10% for 3 seconds at battle start. Interesting. Wielder of the Mystic Sword. Also Tiger Blade. Enhances magic. 
<laughs> That's true. Thank you, Shin. Yes. I'm not looking for a challenge with this uh, game. Dark Souls has given me that just fine. Closest thing to jobs. Okay. Effing jobbers. Do I get cool outfits when I change titles? Because that'd be fun. Um, if I do this, for instance, will my sword go to my left hand? Let's find out. Um, I got another ancient circlet. This one does more. Um, comfort with a K and an E. <laughs> Mortal Comfort. Uh, this one is just technically better, right? Because it has more effects. Is this when I level up the skill list here? Or is this my current skill list? There we go. HP recovery while defending. Plus 10. Oh, great. One comfort, please. You can have it. It's all yours. Support talents. Point of interest detection. Ah, I get you. Okay. And you're making snacks for us. Well, good luck, McLeo. Hope you make the shit out of those snacks, pal. Well, okay, maybe not. Hey, watch out! Don't scare me like that. Sorry about that. <laughs> Jump, I should think we should. Doesn't look like anywhere in the upper floor leads to the other side. Let's check the lower floor one more time. Well, we, we definitely to... can't make it from here. There should be a connected point somewhere. Let's go back and see what we can find. Certainly your right hand, sir. Oh, I have a walk. Oh, look at my walk. <laughs> look at this walk. This is how I walk. That's how I walk. That's a full body workout, this one. See, so that's the deal. Huh? Haven't figured it out? Y yeah, I have. Yeah, I have. Who would have thought you could walk midair? Who would have thought that you could walk in midair here? Mm -hmm. Or that an invisible bridge would be here? Think it could support a person? Well, well, aren't you sharp today? <laughs> For a change. Did my respect meter with Mikleo go up? You know what? I don't care how much it costs. I'm gonna buy like the $15 DLC just to put you in a fucking floaty for the rest of this playthrough. Mikleo. Seems safe enough. Yeah. Oh, the invisible bridge. Discovery points. Unique to each area are discovery points, indicating a place of note in that area. When you know a point is close by, but cannot pinpoint its location, use to look. Use. Okay, use to look around the area. Uh, at save points are located discovery points, the back button prompt may appear at the bottom left of the screen. Press it to begin a skit and enjoy conversations, both illuminating and illuminating. This bridge is incredible! How do you think it was made? Make him wear a cap. I think this oh, is shit. beyond the capabilities of human technology. No, $30 in the hall. So, like, the bridge alone might date from the era of the gods? Possibly, but either way, they definitely had assistance, whether from Seraphim like me or someone else. They really oh, didn't want anyone to reach the other side. The path ahead leads to Elysia. It stands to reason that they do what they can to protect the Pure Land. In the past, any pilgrims who showed up at the shrine probably thought the gap was simply uncrossable. Same as we did until just minutes ago. But good job picking up on that. Your intuition is always impressive. Oh yeah? 
Oh. For its rarity. Hey. Here we go. I knew it was too good to be true. I'm gonna push you off this bridge, pal. Are you okay, lady? Maybe we should rethink this. Hey. <laughs> Mickey was uh, like, ew, Icky, gross. Are you all right? Get out of here. Uh, ew, gross. Uh, I was... I was in a forest, and then... Looking for this? She's human, all right. Yeah. <laughs> Glad Nicolio, you're okay. um, I'm sorry to have troubled shoot some you. water up her skirt. And <laughs> no. you are. Don't do it. Don't do it, Nicolio. Your name. Oh. Right. My name. I'm Saray. I'm sorry. Saray. Mm -hmm. Yep. Nice to meet you. Well met. Is there anywhere one could rest around here? Sure. I'll need to make plans to get back to the capital. You're from the city? Well... Um... Hmm. Why don't you come to where I live? Saray, are you nuts? Are you sure that wouldn't be a problem? You barely know me. I can't just abandon someone in need. That's all. Haven't you noticed that she won't even volunteer her name? It's only natural to be cautious. Sorry, already thinking about banging her. Aren't you going Absolutely. to ask my name? Are you sure? Everyone has their reasons. Big sparks between You don't look like two. a bad person to me. I cannot possibly thank you enough, Saray. <sighs> Gramps is going to let us have it when we get back. I know. Yes? Nah, don't worry about it. Anyway, that's the way out. Let's get moving. Great. Um, is this the way out? Keep your voice down or she'll think you're a basket case. I'll be fine. That's true. Have I noticed you didn't see the McLeo? Yes, I have. Yeah. Hey, are you alright? I appreciate the concern, but I am fine. Think the way. I am right behind you. Um, I'm not going to save, because I'm feeling bold. Nothing can possibly kill me in the opening dungeon. Check the other stairs first. This is going to be a weird party if uh, half of us can't see each other. This place is cool looking. Very nice. I don't want to have to remind you, but keep your eyes on the girl. Uh, okay. okay, can do. Uh, too bad we didn't meet in better circumstances. <sighs> you really don't have a skeptical bone uh, in your body. Okay, I think this is the way out. So what was the other door? Exit. Damn it. I'm gonna go all the way back and check out down there just to be sure. Just to be sure I didn't miss anything. I thought that was the exit. Just so dumb. Oops. See, it is like we're playing Dark Souls. Just lots and lots of backtracking. 
because I'm dumb. Where do we have two exits? I just did this one. Though. It doesn't seem like there's any kind of hidden mechanism, though. How strange. Yeah. Okay, well, now we know it's closed forever. We made it back in one piece. Wow, it's beautiful. Thus ends our adventure. Like a shrine out of myth. I half expect to see Seraphim wandering around. You really do call them Seraphim. Is that funny to you? Nope. Things which cannot be seen or explained, such as gods, spirits, or supernatural phenomena, are revered by the people as Seraphim. Right? A quote from the Celestial Record? Bingo! You've read it too? Yep. Wait, you as well? I used to read it all the time when I was a kid. Dude, you're in. It's a little ways from here Bring to my home. village. Let's get moving. Okay. Is the Celestial Record a children's book? Hmm? Well, I mean, you said you read it when you were a kid. Plenty of adults read it, too. I was probably just mature for my age. Oh, yeah? Oh, uh, don't, don't humble well, brag too figures. much. I mean, it Question is marks. an amazing book. Yes. Well, it looks like someone's enjoying himself. This is my village, Alicia. So it's not Camlon, but Alicia, then. Then the rumors were false after all. To mimic, I'm dead. And that'll do it. You made a chocolate gelato? Um, thanks, pal. What does that do for us? Um, heal everyone for 450 hit points? Nice, thank you. That's really good. <laughs> Restore everyone's initial spirit chain by 10. In the next battle, art defense plus, six, plus 8%. Percent. Okay. What other kind of food can you make, bro? And also, I really want a chocolate gelato for this second. monolith written in ancient tongue. I wish he wouldn't say that after I saw it. Whatever. It appears to be wisdom and yay. Uh, using X and quick step to the side allows you to evade top down and stabbing attacks while still recovering spirit chain. This is called quick evade and it both lowers that enemy's attack frequency and gives you a chance to counter attack and valuable against enemies who only use top down attacks. If you aim to recover spirit chain with quick steps be sure to dodge at the very last second. You need earlier and it merely count as a regular physical dodge topic. Damn, I'm gonna do that a lot. A lot. I have much more AP. Man, it's a herd of Tom Brady's. What are those creatures? What do you mean, creatures? 
They're goats. Actually, they're more like goats? um. Are they usually this big? Antelope or ibex, more than goat. But Highland goat. Such robust horns, just hey, like the dragons of legend. <laughs> what, like in fairy tales? You're something else. Don't go near it. There's no telling how dangerous untamed beasts like those are. Ah, don't worry. We're friends. Oh, well, mostly. They did kick me four or five times when I was little. Your friends? Yep. Sometimes they give me milk, and I make cheese and yogurt with everyone. The mark of true friendship. Yeah, it's the best. Yogurt? I'll go report this to Gramps. Guess we can't keep quiet about all this. Coming by afterwards? Yeah. Hey, everyone. Got someone to introduce to you. This is my family, living here at the shrine. Is this, uh, some kind of performance piece? No, uh, it's nothing. Don't worry about it. You're an odd duck, you know that? I guess. That's my house. You go ahead and rest. I've got something to take care of. May I have a look around the village? Well, sure, but don't cause trouble. Of course not. I'll behave as if I were in a shrine to the Seraphim. Yeah, exactly. I'll try not to make any waves. <laughs> oh, man. I sure hope Miklio's chat with Gramps went over well. This is super awkward, her not seeing all these people. Like, she's just gonna, like, rifle through their drawers and stuff. Um, Saray, I, uh, this is Seraph Kaim. I know I keep saying it, but you've got to be careful with those Hellions. You might be able to drive them off, but you can't do away with them for good. It's a pity, but we Seraphim don't have the power to purify them. Uh, power stance from you. Seraphim Mason, you get it? Don't you, Saray? We're invisible to humans. Just the fact that you can live alongside us like this makes you pretty special. Seraph Natalie, I hate to be the one to say this, but you should send her back as quickly as possible. Well, geez, Natalie... It's the best thing for everyone concerned. Uh, are you jealous of her, Natalie? Well, you should be. Uh, Shiron, hey, you felt that too, right? A disturbance in Gramps' domain? Or maybe I'm just imagining things. Myrna, a bravura performance, Saray. He he he. I suppose that's how it would appear to most humans. Very, very interesting stuff, you guys. There's more goats. Well, she's here already. What's done is done, but you probably ought to cut it back on your ruined adventures a bit. That ruin, let's just say, it goes deeper than you might ever imagine. How natural and untouched a place. I never imagined such a dwelling still existed. Oh. She's interested in things. Uh, Medea? Oh, man. Uh, so, I'm not doing the voice. So you were off scouting about those ruins with Miklio again. And bringing a human girl back with you too? She must be your greatest find yet, no? That's probably right. Loana, could that girl be a knight? A knight's purpose is to fight. Are we safe having her around? She's probably going to kill all of us. Tyler Perry, that's who I was thinking of, man. Not doing that voice though. Uh, Lawrence, a human girl in Alicia, huh? It's the biggest thing to happen here since Gramps turned up here with Baby Saray and Miklio. Is that how that happened? Let me...
I have permission to do the voice. Um, I'm gonna pass nonetheless, you know? Take a hard pass on that. Ed. <laughs> he does look like an Ed. I couldn't care a lot about a human with no resonance. She can't see us, and soon enough, she'll leave. Aren't I right? You're a dick. Yeah. Natural waistcoat. A waistcoat for a man that allows for warm and flexible movement in cold environments. Uh, what did they say about um, uh, leveling up the performance of individual armor? Like, would this eventually get better if I just left it on? Because it doesn't look any better. in here then, huh? Or I should go sleepies? I go no nights? I guess not. Quickly, I went and looking pretty troubled, but don't let it get to you. He and Gramps have the best interests at heart. You know that, right? Okay, I don't know why you're spreading that shit around, but whatever. Melody, I wonder how long it's been since I saw a human other than Saray. At least a couple hundred years. Just hope it isn't a bad omen. And I'll let you hear the rest from Saray himself. I reckon I'll have to. Idiots! Hi, Gramps. I'm back. How could you bring a human into our domain? Easy, Gramps. Didn't you say you'd listen to Soray's side of the story, too? That's just what I'm about to do. You know full well the rules, Soray. How could you break them like this? She was cute. I'm sorry, Gramps, but I couldn't just leave her there. She was cute. Her kind is sure to bring nothing but trouble to our domain. But I'm her kind too, you know. You were raised along with our kind, which nurtured in you the ability to perceive us mm -hmm. and converse with us. Okay. Normal humans have no such capacity. You should understand that. More than anyone else. That's why she's not allowed because you can't understand. Well, it is make true. yourselves known. She doesn't appear to, to have any resonance. Understand you. But Gramps, this is the first time Soray's ever met a fellow human. Perhaps, but if she can't see or hear the same things we do, she has no business in this realm. Ah. Uh. I have raised both of you as my own since you were but babes. All the while doing my best to protect this land. And for that, I am grateful. And I did that because the time draws near when you will both serve to protect this shrine, just as all the others have done. Our priority is the peace of Elysium. Any intruders, no matter how harmless, must be cast out. Yes. Then it's time she left. Can we at least give her time to prepare for her departure? Hmm. Just make it quick. Thank you. You're a dick, Grandpa. Now I see where Mikleo gets it from. Saray is the only true bro among the Seraph. I'm forced Gramps. to conclude that humans are chill and Seraph I know, just... I know, Mikleo. A bunch of knobs. He means well in all things. 
And that's the very reason why I'm so worried for him. Oh, man. That was ugly for a second. What's that? What is what? Uh, Elisark Nest. Oh, hey. There's no baby Elisa larks in the nest anymore. I remember when one of them fell from the nest. I was gonna keep it and raise it, but Gramps wouldn't let me. Yeah, that's a bad idea. A kept bird will never learn to fly, he said. Put it back. Guess you made it out of the nest on your own, huh? Cool. Uh, are you doing karate up on that rock lady? She knows true martial arts. Man, this game is having problems. The land below is so steeped in malevolence that rivers and springs are too poisoned to drink from. Sure sounds like a different world compared to life here in Elysium. <laughs> is that my type? You bet it is, Melody. They have all new dialogue. I don't want to talk to you again. Gramps Thunder is something special, isn't it? I had a great bo I heard a great boom all the way from over here. Time. It's in times of peace when you should be training yourself up to prepare for disasters. You never know when one might come along, after all. Cynthia, she's been making a huge fuss about all the nature and the landscape. Like they're somehow extraordinary. Strange girl. Shira, she doesn't look like she has any ill intent towards us, but the most disturbing thing about humans is that you never know if someone's a scoundrel just from their appearance. He's right. Lawrence, I don't like the idea of keeping watch on her, but I don't see that I have much choice. My first priority is keeping Elysia safe. I'm sorry, but would you mind if I stayed here a little longer? I've always dreamed of a place like this. A dazzling landscape like something out of a fairy tale. Oh, you're all happy and shit. You're a happy person. Oh, yeah, hell yeah. That's the plan. <laughs> okay, act natural. Hey. Mikleo, what are you doing here? I said I've got a girl coming over, man. Hey, wow! Is this crest what I think it is? Yep. This is the mark of the shepherd. Oh, you got a Yu-Gi-Oh glove? That's I knew so it. Cool, man. Nice. The chosen one who communicates with the Seraphim, controlling their incredible powers as if they were his own. The shepherd. <laughs> Sound like your kind of thing? Maybe. Mm -hmm. I always thought that mankind's savior would actually look a bit more imposing. Be silent, Seraph Beast! I shall not. Hmm. Excavated relics aren't play toys. True. She certainly is taking her time. I'll see what's up. Scrubs and spammers are on full force in Street Fighter? Uh-oh. That's too bad. Well, as long as you're beating up on the scrubs, right? You're the only human here, Saray. She can't see us, so I'd imagine she thinks you're mighty weird. I suggest you do what you can to act suspicious, not act suspicious, or make her nervous. A super scrub like those scrubs, though I imagine she's plenty discombobulated already. Actually, hold up. Kind of throw trap. Oh, that's too bad. Look at this 
dirty game just stopping. She's really odd. God, you guys never stop talking. Just sitting there the whole time, staring at the landscape. That's the same thing you said before. <laughs> it's getting chilly. You should show her. It's a good idea. This guy gets it. Lawrence gets it. You beat on that asshole? Hmm. It's, it's a way to go about it. But then, come to mention it, we've just been sitting here the whole time, staring away at her. Yeah. Um, I really don't want to go talk to all you other people again. I don't see a point to it. Okay. Enjoy yourself? I sure did. But it's weird. I felt like I was being watched the whole time. Uh, uh. Shall we eat? I'm sorry. I feel like I'm going to faint. Right. Let's head to my place. Shirt blends in with the green screen sometimes. Oh no, it is happening. Oh, that's because of the, uh, um grass in this game. It uh, reflects. If there's any reflection in the shirt at all, it, uh, yeah. So yeah, that's what's happening. See, it happens less up here and more there. See that shit? Ooh, cured green. So there you go. That's fine. Um, it is a very Gosh, green grass. I hope we didn't worry him. Hmm? Oh, uh, nothing. Are you in my party or what? Yeah. It's not like I was worried. <laughs> Welcome in. Mantar sure would never do that. It probably would in this, this scenario. It's extremely green scenery. Very green. Super green. Oh, do you always eat on the floor like a freaking savage, Saray? Hey! She doesn't look impressed. So then, what's your hometown like? You are blowing this well. area. I'm from the capital, Lady Lake, in the Kingdom of Highland. Lady Lake? Lady Lake? Like in the Legend of the Sacred Blade? Yes, there's only slamming hotties You've in the heard city of, it? of Lady Lake. It was in the Celestial Record. The legend says the Lady of the Lake guards the Sacred Blade, and the one who draws it becomes the Shepherd, right? Yes. It was a lively and bustling town, blessed with bountiful water, rich in festivals and fine drink. <sighs> Wait, Man, especially was? Here, well, it used to be. Things must be hard for folks in the world below. Below? The land that lies beneath the mountaintops. I've never left home before. You've always lived here by yourself? Mm. Sounds to me like you're the one who's had it rough. <laughs> Oh, let me help you get ready for your return trip tomorrow. You need anything? Bread, rations, stuff like that? That'd be great. If you have any tools or a sleeping bag, it'd be great too. <laughs> okay, your majesty. Gotcha. Well then, first we'll need to do some hunting. I'll be your guide tomorrow. Thank you so much for everything. Good morning. Good morning. Come on! Hurry it up, Mikleo. We ain't got time to mess around. Who is that? Yeah, I'll leave in a moment. <sighs> Gramps gave me all kinds of things to take care of. I'm gonna be pretty swamped for a while. That was Gramps? Bummer. Well, don't you worry about me, at least. So, Ray, Gramps only wants... Yeah, I know. <laughs> Mikleo! Maybe later. Sure. Good morning. You sleep okay? Yeah, like a log. Been yeah. ages since I've done that. Got banged right, so then. hard, Shall we? slept like a piece of wood. It's been so The prickle long boars lurk to the left happened. of the entry gate. It's an ideal hunting place. Got it. You're a beast, Saray. You're a beast. Show some respect, sir.
Oh, you're petting the flowers? Well, I guess you don't have shit else to do living for thousands of years. It's not like every day you see Saray hanging out with someone other than Mickley. <laughs> That's true. Wrecked by Fat Honda. Nice. Mirna, I'm really sorry, Saray. We'd like to help, but she can't see us. We'd only startle her. Is she from the capital? If she is, you need to pass on all the wisdom we shared with you about nature, Saray. Cynthia, don't worry. She'll be fine in your hands, Saray. After all, you were the one who brought her here, so it falls on you to look after her. Well, okay, that's accurate. Um, let's see if I can talk to Grandpa real quick. Invisible, visible. Uh, Grandpa won't even talk to me when I'm. I got a girl with me. Jeez, Grandpa. Me or do you folks look to be having too much fun? Hey, we should see to it that she gets home safely. We don't want anyone thinking Alicia is a village of hard hearted meanies now. We do. Lawrence is the man, he's the only one who's chill. Tachio, that crest on her back looks familiar. Hmm. What is that? First of all, she looks like Pink Mercy. Bullshit, Nicleo's not coming with me. He's coming. Oh, she's finally in my party. What do you have now? Let's do a list. Um, a title fit for one who sees opportunities in the bewildering soil of battle. Unleashes hidden lance arts to pierce openings. So I'll do the same. Heart attack plus 4%. Stun rate plus 10 for 3 seconds. Damage reduced by... Is that enemy damage? Is it damage to me, I think? Yeah, it's like defense up. stick with that. I don't think we've checked that monolith out yet. Targeting. While targeting an enemy, press B to view more details about them. You can learn about their characteristic attacks, so it's worth trying out when encountering an enemy for the first time. Data is sometimes updated after you defeat an enemy, so you get the habit of researching your foes. The target icon will also give you a rough idea of the enemy's remaining HP. Huh. Is that out of battle? Because in battle, that's attack. The game is dropping frames. Well, that's where we're going, isn't it? What the fuck are we doing? 
Oh, okay. <sighs> oh, that's right, we're going hunting. Wait, we're not hunting goats, are we? No, the goats are our friends. Ah, that's much better. Good. There's a pickle boar. So that's one, huh? Their meat is easy to preserve when smoked and super tasty. And the skin has all kinds of uses too. I almost feel sorry for it. Oh, Believe don't give me that shit. No, my spirit is prepared. <laughs> Besides, I can't get this sort of experience uh, back home. That was okay. <laughs> my spirit is prepared. To murder Here this pickle boar. Trust me, we're gonna murder lots. Don't worry about it. Did you see that move? Hey, Ouch. pretty smooth move. Thank you. It's You're so rather hard. capable yourself. Yeah. Ready? Strike! How's this? Go! Yeah! Hang on, everyone! Strike! How's this? <laughs> it's Go. over! Good fight. We got purple boar hide and our okay, great. Okay. Guess we need a few more. I don't see any around. You'll find him if you look. Oh, I missed a chest from before. Run away! I want to target you! Oh, that's good. Focus, guys! Yeah! Ready? No escape! How's this? Hang on, everyone! Have I Too easy. truly been of use? Yeah, the game is really dropping a lot of frames. It's not me. The game is doing it. It's not great looking. Imagine it's much fun for the boars, but the circle of life goes on. Thank you for introducing me to all these customs. I learned much accompanying you today. Such a flirt. Hey, there's one. Focus, guys! Ready? Strike! Ready? Strike! How's this? Yeah! in return. How many do we have? Seven. I finished preparing the gel. There's one. 
Focus, guys! Ha. Strike! Those games! I think we've hunted enough. So, now what shall we do? Don't worry. I'll teach you how to make jerky and bags and sleeping gear out of it. I am truly in your debt, Saray. <laughs> Let's head oh, on I for the day. <laughs> It's cute. I mean, I like that they like each other and all, but... Yeesh. Hey, how far is it to Lady Lake? Let's see. I expect about two or three days. Really? I had no idea it was so close. But the forest at the base of the mountain is surprisingly easy to get lost in. Must be the power of Gramps' domain. Hey, Sean. No one's saying you're right. Those Purgle Boards are allegiance, too, so don't go teasing them too much. I just killed several of them. That's true. Saray. Saray? Oh, did I wake you? Sorry about that. You're sure into that book, aren't you? I've read it countless times since my childhood. One day, I want to explore ruins all over the world. Everyone who's read the Celestial Records says that, and I'm no exception. But sadly, now is not the time for some jaunt around the world. For several years now, the world has been plunged into a nigh incomprehensible state of chaos. Chaos? Mysterious illnesses, incessant storms, people bursting into flames. That's a bad one. There are those that say, even the dead have begun to walk the earth again. Whoa, hang on. What are you talking about? Dark souls, man. Dark souls. You don't believe me? Or you think this is a joke? Shared universe. No, I... The situation is beyond grave. Huh? The chaos has caused abnormal climate changes all over the world. As a result, we are on the verge of enduring widespread crop death, famine, and starvation. And worst of all, are the rumors of governments planning to replenish their dwindling resources through war. What? It mustn't come to that. Can nothing be done? Sounds like the beginning of a uh, Who knows? Miyazaki movie. There's nothing to hang on to but legends. Which is why you... No, never mind. I won't ask. I think I'm gonna just hit the hay here myself. Sleep well. I'll just sleep in my armor. It's really comfortable. Good morning. Good morning. You ready to get to work? We gotta make those rations and bags from the prickle boars we hunted yesterday. You got it. <laughs> Afraid it isn't exactly super fun, though. Well, let me know when you're ready to start. I don't really see any reason not to start now. Oh, 
let's do it. Ready? Yeah. So, what do you need me to do? Sorry for putting you to work like this. Oh, I'm pretty used to it. With your help, I'll be able to leave tomorrow. Thanks so much. Yeah? Great. Well, better rest up for tomorrow. I ought to let Gramps know. Wish I'd asked her more about the world below. Um... Oh, sorry, I was just studying your collection of relics. This is indeed a treasury of rare objects. I'm humbled and impressed that you were able to gather them all by yourself. Such a suck at MC. I know, he just wants her out of here, and it bothers me. You know? I don't understand why he's got to step on uh, Saray's toes like this. Ed, yeah, you got no cause to fret, Saray. You're not the shepherd, after all. Nothing you need to trouble yourself with. Ba ba ba. Uh, Kaim, apparently the land below has entered a time they call the Age of Chaos. Hey, Simply C, how's it going? Um. Uh, it's okay. This game's fine. Um, it's my it's my colorful, cute, cartoonish uh, answer to Dark Souls, and it's all those things and more. So. Yeah. I decided to quit Divinity Original Sin, because I, it was a bit, yeah, gotta turn up the action a bit. Turn up the action on the stream. Hey Gramps, she says she's leaving tomorrow. I see. We'll all be sure to see her off. After all, one must always be hospitable to one's guests. <sighs> Thanks! <laughs> was that a smile, Grandpa? Uh, that's okay. No problem. I give bits to get bits. I really owe you. Tales Thank of you so much. I played a little bit that, of You're that as be well. Okay by yourself. I cannot cause more trouble for you than I already have. I did not finish it though. I see. So. <sighs> you'll be fine. Just follow that map and you'll get through the forest with no problems. Oh, it's not that. I believe you. Alicia. That's my name, Alicia Difta. I was gonna ask when he was gonna ask her name. Alicia? You didn't even know who I was, and you helped me without asking anything in return. Whereas I thought only of myself, leaving you without even a name by which to call me. As a knight, I am ashamed. Please find it in your heart to forgive me. It's okay. I must confess something to you. Hmm? I know this sounds strange, but I believe that the Seraphim really do exist. The myths and <laughs> legends that are preserved in the Celestial no Record must be more than mere fairy tales. This crisis that has befallen our world, I believe only the ones spoken of in the ancient legends can truly restore order. The Shepherd, you mean? You're not going to ridicule me? Everyone back in town does. Jackbox of course early, that's right. <laughs> You're a real saint, you know that? And she moved my mic again as the she always does. The Sacred Blade Festival is soon to commence in Lady Lake. A trial will be held based on the legend of the Shepherd's Sword. A trial I think you might be interested in. Me? Are you using me? Down the bottom. Time to go. Know, right? But please... A robot overseer as well, not time. take over. How come? The shepherd I see in my mind when I read the legends. I have to say, he reminds me a lot of you. I would do anything for you, so yeah, let's go. What's this? Why do you keep giving me shit Gramps one asked time? me to go out and search the ruins and find some clues about that girl. I've been down there looking. So wait, this is Alicia's? 
This is the crest of Highland. I don't think this Alicia is any ordinary knight. I know this is difficult for you, but it really is for the best. Would you quit changing your fucking mind, old man? Gramps? Hmm. Someone has infiltrated my domain. Automod is the start of Skynet. Blasted I thought so. Damnation! Yeah. Hiding yeah. your presence, are you, crafty bugger? It'll Everyone it'll uh, become. Be warned! There is an intruder I'm sorry. Do you have pegs for legs? Find them. They've concealed their presence, so chances are good it's a hellion. Search with extreme caution. We'll go too. Very well. If it is a hellion, quick measures must be taken. I'm no. counting on you. You're just standing I have on a hunch heels. We'll find it around the forest. What the fuck, dude? Good idea. You didn't like how short you were, so you decided to be a little less short. <laughs> what a weird guy. Um, what's up, Grandpa? Even if you should encounter the Hellion, you mustn't challenge it. I'm totally going to. This one has all, all indications of being far more powerful than the weedy spiders you fought off in the ruins. Poor Hells. <laughs> Double Hells. Uh, Hellions aren't the type to just step inside Gramps' domain by mistake. There's a clear aim behind this one's actions. That's true. A Hellion's malevolence here in Elysia. Such a thing hasn't been seen since... Never mind. What are you concealing, old man? Melody, I knew it. I had a bad feeling about it from the start. Think Leo and Saray, you mustn't push yourselves too hard. You're the youngest ones here in Elysia, after all. Uh, I don't really want to talk to all you guys. Let's just move forward. We gotta talk to Lawrence. He's the only chill bro there is. These Hellions are no joke. Make sure you're always in a group of at least two. And I just realized how silly I sounded telling you two that. Okay. Don't worry, Lawrence. You're the man. It's fine. Look at that. Even that giant mountain in the back has uh, old ruins on it. Okay, here we are. Ah! ah! What was that? Well, I think we should ignore that. It's probably nothing. Ah! Mason! Mason? How odd. Oh man, he I was the douchiest one. Find anything but the main course here. But now there's two more side dishes. <laughs> what on earth is this thing? Is this the Hellion? This is not the place for one such as you. Leave at once. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Impudent brat. Ishimaru? Is that was that my I dude's name in uh, wafting off of you. Those Naruto? tender arms trying to conceal their shivers. <laughs> Mmm. Aren't you a succulent treat? Dude, what message are you trying to get across what? here? Did I stutter? I'm saying I'm going to eat you. As if. I can take you. Prepare to meet your doom, Hellion. Oh, we are going to fight him. 
Set Heavenly Torrent on the arts menu and unleash the art. Okay, what? Um, arts menu. Uh, okay. What am I doing here? Set Heavenly Torrent on the arts menu and unleash the hidden art with A. I don't have that, man. Oh, there it is. Cool. Form hidden hearts with A. Combos combining both martial and hidden hearts are possible. For instance, you can use a hidden art to target an enemy's weakness before following up with a martial art. You can set up to five hidden arts in combination with L in the arts menu. If nothing set in the top slot, pressing A will let the system choose from any of your current hidden arts. That's kind of helpful, actually. Yeah. Yeah. Aren't you? Yes, we'll avenge our friend. Still haven't had enough yet. Be gone. Dude, Mason! you guys just let them do this? He's like a cell, I guess. He ate Mason. Is is this what Hellions are capable of? Away with you, evil being! Or you want to take us all on at once? Hmm. I shouldn't be snacking anyway. Not when the main course is getting away. Mason. Mason, we stood here and did nothing while you got eaten. We can handle the rest. Gramps, that fox looking thing. Was that really a Hellion? They can talk to us? Yes. That's the form He's of so a charismatic. Human who has he is charming. Yep. Corrupted, essentially. Humans can become Hellions? Now, it's time you went back home and rest. We should. Come on, let's head back. Right. So, it begins anew. How do your shoes not get caught in the dirt, man? Uh, we leveled up, learned a new art, got Windmaster Talisman. Mm -hmm. hmm. Oh, we are not sleeping under covers in this What on game, earth man. did it come here to do? Oh, oh. <laughs> Why don't you show me I that one face again? I to find anything but the main course <laughs> here. <sighs> Not when the main course is getting away. Wait a minute. Was it going after her? Our adventure begins. Learned Heavenly Torrent. We sure did.
Yeah. I will leave that blank. Hold on. Put that on up. Otherwise, it'll just do it. So that works out fine. Yep. They'll probably freak out with me gone suddenly. Sorry, everyone. <laughs> sorry, not sorry. Okay. Oh. Whoa! <laughs> Miglio! Why are you here? Thought I'd let you duck out of here. Do you well, need all those belts, I'm going sir. to. Seriously? We can talk more while we travel. We don't have time. But from what the Foxman said, it's fair to assume that he's after Alicia. You picked up on that too, huh? Of course. Now, let's hurry. Hey! What? What's gotten into you all of a sudden? I'm just really happy you came with me. Oh, sorry, he's gonna cry. He likes Mikleo. I couldn't let you navigate the world of humans alone. Not as guileless as you are. I bet Gramps is mad, though. He was ready for it, in a way. He knew you'd leave someday. Hey, I'm just stepping out for a bit. I'll see him again. Gramps has always known that once you left, you'd live the rest of your days with humans. <laughs> Is this from Gramps? He. We'll just, need money to get by. Wherever you go, society. just smoke mad weed. He said to sell that if we remember us right. when you smoke uh, and get super high. And there's a message for you as well. Walk the path you believe in, and live your life to the fullest. And I know you will not go astray. Jimmy That's Choo Pex. Let's go. Actual anime cutscene. <gasps> Incredible. By themselves, people are such frail things. That is why, in times of calamity, they pray for a ship to save. <laughs> this is really it! This is our world! The era later known as the Age of Chaos gave birth to a new ship. Hey Dave. Uh, high class high heel shoes. Oh, okay. <laughs> that was a great intro. Damn.
man, dude. Uh, okay. That's a lot more impressive than Crippled. I'm good. This is some shredding guitar right now, apparently. Character be a Oh, she does foot kicks. That's character already. Hey, Sir Ray, how are you? Um, I don't know how to pronounce your name because of this game. After we get through the um, forest, we should reach the lake. Then we just have to head down the slope. Got it. But wait a minute. How do you know all Shut this? up so I can talk. It's not complicated. I've been collecting information for this very day. On your own? You never told me about it. Um, am I into racing games? I've never streamed one, but um, I do like racing games quite a bit. I enjoyed... Uh, the Verizon, Verizon, Jesus, Forza series. Um, when I had an Xbox, um, and uh, I do like Burnouts as well. Those are fun games. Oh, the dirty, dirty hitches. Yeah, this game is dropping like every it drops a frame for no reason. I don't like it. Interesting. You got an invite for the crew too? Like a uh, beta thing or something? Chamomile. Hmm. I wonder if I can smash those later. I don't necessarily want to go out, though. I want to explore. This is my first Tales game. I've uh, started this one before, and I've started Vesperia before. I've never finished one or gotten all that far in either one. Um, so, technically, yeah, this will be my first Tales game. And I haven't attempted this one in a long time. Closed beta runs until June 4th. Interesting. Yeah, I might be interested in that. You want to send me a whisper? You save, please. Thank you. Hmm. Wish I had this on console. I don't think I'd be getting these uh, graphics hitches right now. i got to find a solve for that. Sisteria was your first game? Yeah. Oh, we got wolves. I see a snack up in the distance. 
Oh, wait, no, snacks are sexy in here. Um, they were talking about target. What was that action about? I'm ready. A wolf? No, it's a hellion. It'll attack once it gives chase. Ready? It's over. It's over. Oh, this pauses. Okay. Ah, there we go. Hey, Watchman. It's your favorite RPG game of all time. That's great. So this is how... And I can see their HP. Uh, a wolf, you don't ever see these around Elysia too often, but I've never seen one so vicious. Is this what Hellionization does to a creature? Um, okay. Now I understand. Hold down RB to confirm your target. While doing this, you can also switch targets using that. Tapping RB will automatically switch targets to the enemy nearest to you. Great. How's this? Can't believe we'd run into a hellion all of a sudden. Chris Aria's nice though. I own um quite strange. I hope it's just a coincidence. I don't know if I got rid of the Tales game I had for 360. I, I had um Vesperia, but I have Versaria, Symphonia, and of course this one. Use the strategy menu to direct your allies. Action, basic instructions, such as which enemy to target. Tactics would balance the strike between close range and long range arts. Attack rate, how often the character should attack. Uh, defense and healing, set HP threshold for prioritizing and recovery and defense instructions. Apply to any character whose control mode is set to auto. Could it be I'm attracting them because they know I can see them? Who can say? It's too early to tell. Attacks. It's amazing how they can move oh, their I arms see. and legs. Command the whole party with this is a charge. Priority is attack. Spread out. Each member targets a different enemy. Focus attacks. Attack the player's target. Prioritize defense. Only defend, recover, or evade. Okay. Back to display the control mode for the controlled character and press again to cycle between the dual modes. Manual, semi auto, and I knew it couldn't have been a coincidence. They're attracted to us somehow. It was a quick scene. Thanks for the follow, sir. Right? How you find this, this area? I'm not really sure. Um, I'm sure it was uh, the first game I bought. I, I think. Remember, this place was in the Celestial Record. Oh, nice. Um, I can't remember how I first got turned on to Tales games. It was definitely when I first bought um, Vesperia. Um, yeah, it must have just shown up on a sale or something, and it looked interesting. I tried it. Uh, found a new discovery point. Natural lookout point. Check out that view. Even the air seems different somehow. Definitely a change from Gramp's blessed domain. Alicia said the world below is full of malevolence. Can you feel it at all? I don't get that impression, personally. Me neither. I mean, it's so pastoral. Well, 
Don't judge a book by its cover, as they say. But for now, at least we get a nice view. It's your first time here too, isn't it? What do you say? Are you pumped? Pumped? Well, mildly inflated at least. <laughs> okay. Lady Lake, uh, a roundite forest. Watch your step on the lookout rock. Okay. It's quick save, actually, quick save. There's the lake. And there's a huge city. Let's go check it out. Hidden arts can overpower an enemy's martial arts. So when an enemy comes after you with a series of troublesome martial arts, try countering with your own series of hidden arts. On the other hand, hidden arts take more time to cast and consume more spirit chain. To fully master them, you need to consider when and how to best utilize them, whether in combos or other situations. Thanks for all the great advice you gave me. Encounter a stronger foe. I think we're gonna yeah, we're gonna find more stronger foes than snakes and wolves, buddy. <laughs> now I really feel like I'm actually in another world. It's great to have a field trip and all, but try not to get us lost, please. <laughs> we'll be just fine. I got us a map. Oh, you mean the one that's in the Celestial Record? It's kind of old, though. I'll probably need to redraw parts of it as we go along. Hmm. You can now view the world map by pressing the uh, right stick outside of battle. From here, you can view map information, such as which enemies appear in the area. Oh, it even gives you item drops. Oh my god. Oh my god. What are the percentages on good drops? Oh god. We're gonna be farming shitty drops, aren't we? Oh, Tails games. Ready, Nicleo! Ready? How's this? Alright! Close! It's over! Be gone! Strike! Go! Alright! Flow and surge! Go! Ready? Just managed to thanks, Ray. Uh, thanks for the follow. Appreciate that. Um, we'll see you uh, hopefully again soon. We'll be playing more of this. I'll think of you every time I play this game. I promise. Like many of us, martial, hidden, and seraphic arts are all caught in a web of antagonistic wall chips. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> That's a weird uh, setup for your mechanic. Um, martial arts interrupt seraphic art casting. During hidden arts, you're immune from being staggered by martial arts. While casting seraphic arts, you're immune from being staggered by hidden arts. Thus, if an enemy only uses one type of art, you have an opportunity to pound them with the superior type. So, martial arts interrupt seraphic. Hidden arts, you're immune from being staggered by martial, while casting seraphic arts, you're immune from being staggered by hidden. I'll never remember that. That's a rich guy laugh. Oh yeah, I'm loaded. Looks like it. The cart stopped. No, no, no. I stick my chin this far out. That's how you know I'm wealthy.
Oh, Sorry, Doggo. There's a dog here. Yeah, there is. Oh, hi, Doggy. Ah, he's so cute. He is cute. Look at him. That's your bark. Are you okay? Hey, Nick Leo, why don't you pet him? Animals like this one can sense us. It gives me the willies. <laughs> <laughs> it's not funny. Everyone has things they're afraid of. Afraid of doggos, are you? Oh, what's the matter? Are you crying? We're the Sparrow Feathers, a traveling caravan of merchants. I'm Agil, the captain. She's Rose. Hi, Rose. Nice to meet you. Hi, future party member. I'm Saray. Nice to meet you, too. You finally learned how not to be a creeper. Shut it. <laughs> Oh, hey, so if you're a traveling caravan, where are you traveling to? <laughs> We're going all over the world. Wow. We're protected by a free trade treaty, meaning we have a free pass to pretty much go anywhere we please. That's pretty sweet. Sure, we get asked to smuggle all sorts of crap, but for us, trust is first and foremost. I bet you say that to all the Dishonorable smugglers. trade is fine for dishonorable people, but we do things our own way. Uh, smuggling is great. We may need that. And we are damn proud of it. This must Haven't you the seen these games? We always have to work against minutes. the government. Sure seems that way. Come on now. Yeah. We're planning to stay in Lady Lake for a while. If you need anything, just give us a holler. Yeah. We will. Thanks. So they really ought to focus on their cart before drumming up business. <laughs> we have to say, uh, Nucleo? Well, even the land below can't be all excitement all the time, but hey, this is a good chance for you to practice talking with humans some more. That's a good point. I do suck at that. Are you sure they were regular old wolves? Are wolves prone to attack in broad daylight like that? Well, they did. The highlight of the Sacred Blade Festival is the Trial of the Sword. It's a re recreation of the legendary shepherd drawing the sword from the stone. Talfrim. Those wolves were pretty bold coming to attack the caravan. I guess they must have been seriously angry. Your name is E. Guile. Sorry for all the trouble. We were attacked by a pack of wolves. We overdid it a bit trying to get out of here. Oh wow, that's some knife you got there. Think you could part with it for a thousand gold? A thousand gold? Sell the royal knife? No. Aw, too bad. Let me know if you change your mind. Oh wow, that's some... Aw, let me know if you change your... You're my quest? I have to do this? Well, it looks like I have a couple options here. Princess Alicia came through here when she got back to the capital. I would have loved to see the so-called Princess Knight for myself. Princess, Princess Alicia, huh? Phew. Sounds like she made it back safe. Glad to hear that Fox Freak didn't catch up to her. But still, to think that she was royalty. No kidding. A straight-up princess? A princess, a knight, and she explores ruins on the side? How'd she wind up with that gig? Won't know until we ask her. That's true. Besides, Foxy Loxy might be in town waiting for a chance to get at her. Yeah, we've got to let her know. Um, I can explore that over there, or that too, right? Good job, Mikleo. Made us a fruit frappe. Great work. The entry paperwork? Sure. Take care of it now, and I'll let you in just as soon as that cart's fixed. All right. I'll be right on it. Hmm. Paperwork? Hey, everyone. <laughs> I'm Sorry from about the hassle. heaven.
Well, that was well-timed. Welcome to Lady Lake. for no reason. And it is a good reason. We got a soft serve ice cream. Lots of vanilla, surprisingly hard to shape correctly. Um, alright. Well, they're giving us a bunch of stuff here already, so I'm not gonna go that much further. In fact, this is, is that it. a monolith? Changing the control mode. Changing the control mode to manual gives you the flexibility to attack from the distance you choose. For example, you can use projectile arts to pin an enemy down from a distance. Of course, you can achieve a similar effect even in semi-auto by directly following a quick step with an art. Like all tools, it depends on how you use it. We'll just go back. Go down that way for a bit. See if we can't see anything neat, and then head over to the bridge. Seraphic Arts characters use Seraphic Arts use attacks of greater power and reach the martial or hidden arts, but at the cost of longer casting times. By continuing to hold down A beyond unnecessary casting time, you can keep a charge while you use the L to switch targets before unleashing your own. Got another broken cart situation, fellas. Stay back, we are currently dealing with wild animals that are causing havoc in the area. Are you here for the Sacred Blade Festival? By any chance, Lady Lake is that town over there, floating in the lake? Uh, we'll be on security detail, so you just relax and have a good time. Thanks, pal. like I can't believe it oh, so this is how humans live don't they find it overwhelming wow gosh you'd think so just remember this isn't a sightseeing trip the real question is do we try to find Alicia first or look for the fox man so let's have a look around town for now good call let's gather information Gather information. That's the most D&D thing you can do. Oh, 
Oh jeez. Aerial recovery. When knocked down, when knocked back through the air, use X to land safely. That's a good one. I need that one. Uh, hold on. Never mind. Feels like ages since the last time I had this much fun. It's been years since the last Sword Fest. Sword Fest? That sounds awesome. Oh, I didn't want to exit. Oh, damn it. I wanted to talk to him. I'll just run back. Told you, don't go off on your own. It's crowded in front of the sanctuary and you end up getting lost. Come on, let's hurry to the sanctuary. I've got to be over before we even get... God, the goods are still aren't here yet. The festival is about to start. Oh, hi there. Sorry to keep you waiting, but we're not quite ready to open yet. Do us a favor and come back a bit later. Okay. Okay. Waiting on a delivery, and you'll have some stuff. Oh, nice. Hmm. Hey, son. How about these duds? Made from real silk. My old lady will swap me for it, but they're yours for just 860 gold. I don't have that money, though. Oh, is that cheap? <laughs> Saray, behind him. Oh, look at you. Uh, should we give it what for? And have everyone think you're attacking the street vendor? You want to tour the inside of a human jail cell? To everyone else, he looks just like an ordinary human. Oh, yeah. So, we're not buying a six? Why'd they make it so big? It'll take ages to find our way around. I guess we'll have to deal with it, though. Here we go again, sword fest. It won't be long before the dregs of society are drying out their holes by the lure of these simple-minded folks, coin purses. Hey, man, is he talking about cons? Did I tell you already? Your sister goes with you, or you're not going to go to the festival at all. You don't want to lose your allowance for the rest of the week. Every time I look at that water wheel, I'm amazed by its size. It's like it cleanses my heart just to see it turn. Uh, hold on, guys. I have to do some uh, off-stream research here. Um, these little frame drops are annoying me. I want to see if there's fixes I can do for that. Hmm. 
That might work. Okay. We won't do it this stream. We'll have to do it later. But there are solutions for these uh, small frame drops and pitches. We'll just have to do that. Do those later on. We'll have to leave with them for the rest of this stream, which will be about 45 minutes. We'll end uh, this stream then. Because then I will go get some food. And then I'll come back and we'll uh, tackle Dark Souls again. There's a rumor the princess had gone missing, but it looks like she's returned to her mansion in the Nova. It sure is lively around here. So many people. Don't let your guard down. A crowd just means more Hellions lurking about, drawn to people's corrupted hearts. Understand now, child. No matter how tough things get, stealing is stealing. You stole, you little Shut bastard. Shut up, old man. You smell like farts. Ha ha ha! You're right. He does. Yeah, stealing's the best. <laughs> that kid rocks. He gave way you for, old man. This festival standards have really dropped. I guess what's that's what a bad harvest will bring you. Grilled sweet fish to munch on. Oh, may I get the salted one? Mm -hmm. Hello, <laughs> Bruno. We're gonna pull out. Yep, pull out method is the best way. Yeah. Can't A couple of Kimaris haven't had it. Uh, boom. That's different. Indeed. We best not get involved. No, let's get involved. Cowards. Whew, guys, it's getting worse and worse. Ah, oh, come on. Personnel only. If you're here for the sword pulling contest, you gotta go. Oh, come on, man. Do like that. There should be a vista point nearby. The sanctuary up ahead is supposed to house a sword protected by the Lady of the Lake. Wait, are you getting in line? No way! First we've got to make sure Alicia's safe. I'm sure we'll be back. Hit points. Okay, you can recover by being KO'd by using a life bottle, winning the battle. If you grow in strength, you may acquire other ways to revive yourself. Uh, where is this vista point?
Great Sanctuary of the Sacred Blue. Whoa! No one told me the sanctuary would be this gorgeous. You can tell the shepherd myth is a big part of the culture here. Strange, though. There's no sense of blessing at all. Now that you mention it, we could always feel Gramps' blessing back in Elysia. Granted, Gramps is a particularly powerful seraph, but even so, this town has a high concentration of malevolence. It's honestly making me a little sick. <laughs> you gonna be okay? For now, at least. I'm starting to think it'd be a bad idea to stay too long, though. This place has even more Hellions than we imagined. They're wandering around right there in front of us, and yet we can't do a thing. I'm as frustrated as you are, but our hands are tied. We don't have the power of purification. Besides, there's a reason for the Hellion manifestations. They're feeding on the evil in people's hearts. And in such a pretty town. Probably part and parcel of life in human cities. Nicolia, don't get all weepy on me, buddy. Hmm. Okay, we'll go that way then. There was no hint as to why I would go this way, but we will go this way. Because the game says so. I really doesn't stand a chance. He's like nowhere near pure enough. <laughs> Everyone talks about pulling out that sword, but I know it's just a big excuse to put on a festival. That thing doesn't even come out, I'm sure. Might be right. Oh, it's the kid who loves stealing and calls the old man Farty Man. Huh? What the hell you want now? Whoa. <laughs> what, you got a problem? Time to kill him. Oh, hey, mister. You smell like you'd be mighty tasty. We're gonna have hey, to kill a child. No, let's murder this child. Wow. <laughs> Don't tell the child is too scary. Young folk these days simply don't have any respect for the Seraphim. I mean, when you think of the real origin of the Sacred Blade Festival, mumble grumble. That's all you can say. Hey, we're friends, right? Can you lend me some cash? It doesn't have to be much. The thing is, I've gone and gotten my wallet stolen. Aw, uh, dude, you're asking your friends for money? Oh, uh, that sucks. Phew, that's all deliveries done and dusted. This is the first time I've done the Sacred Blade Festival. It's a pretty fair, full lot of fair, isn't it? Full up? Oh, piss off, man. Be full up. They just go in your rooms anyway. This room looks pretty empty to me, lady.
Oh yeah, we are going to install some mods to fix this. Fix the shit out of you. Oh, you too. Oh, you're in love with the maid with the twin tails. Oh, buddy. I'll make sure to meet, get you a souvenir. Next time we meet, I'll be able to tell you all my exciting travel tales. God, dudes, I can't handle it. Yeah, we're going to have to abort this stream soon. So I can uh, fix this goddamn game. This is no way to stream. The stuttering is way too bad. The simpering and smiling at royalty and frilly coat people is rather wearing me out. I totally get that. <sighs> next, uh, next save point. That dog. What's gotten into it? Yeah, get him, boy. He's here. Next no mistake. Point, That's sorry. the fox man. Fox man. After him. You're the fox, fox man. I explore. So Alicia really is the fox man's target. What is Looks that? like it. He probably retreated. No from game controllers in the box? I don't get it. Sympathy, how's it going? Good morning. Uh, I'm trying to play this video game, but uh, we have some pretty severe stuttering going on, so I'm actually going to end the stream pretty soon. But uh, thanks for popping in. I also don't know where this damn dog is. Chase after the dog. thought that he would be this fast. The dog's Curious. still chasing him. We can't let him get away. Excuse <coughs> <coughs> me. It's safe. Looks like he cornered it. Are you ready? Look at you little stumpy puppo. that wasn't a quick time event. Your chicken hunting days are over, Fox. 
Wow, the slowdown is so filthy. <coughs> I gotta so, fix this game you're really real that bad. Eager to die, are you? Do you always have to go back to back before we start a fight? boss or nobody you're just a guy dang he's a lot stronger than I remember are you shitting me we're wrecking him when we fought him back in Elysia he must have been weakened by Gramps's blessing I'll burn you to cinders love the hair though Going to enjoy this. A fitting end for worms who dare to wriggle at a god. <sighs> Boss! No, I swear, mm -hmm. I, I wasn't. Quiet. Ooh. Who. Who are you? We won't warn you again. Be silent. All right, if you insist. Have you forgotten our code, Lunar? You're all out of second chances. Understood? Go. The assassination order was a mistake. Princess Alicia will no longer be our target. What? Do you expect me to believe that? We have our honor. I don't think you do. You're assassins, Say. though. The princess's enemies are legion. For those who wish to remove her, assassination is but one option among many. You have bigger worries than who we are or what we do. Why are you giving me hints? You hurry to the pedestal where the sacred blade is kept. You're why? Why are you, you telling me this? Exactly. Honor. So, I guess I should be thanking you for saving us. Hmm. Hey. Are you all right? What? What in the world? Looks like we were saved by an assassin's guild. By a what? They were after Alicia by mistake or something. They took that fox guy away with them. But more than that, it looks like Alicia's not out of danger yet. Looks like? What's going on? Hey, I don't get it any more than you do. Let's just hurry to that pedestal. Oh man, this game is so broken right now. All right, we're gonna save and quit, guys. Get the hell out of here. I will attempt to fix this off of the streets. I can sense the ancient tongue. We're near one. The ancient tongue, gross. Uh, you should always keep your SC level high, except when you shouldn't. Uh, when you think you can defeat the enemy, by all means, go all out with your attacks. I know this is. Hint I've already got. If, you attack, if the enemy attacks frequently, though, you'll need to guard more, which in turn gives you more chances to recover a scene. Cool, man. That makes perfect sense.
Thank you, Watchman, for the follow. I wonder if you're a fan of the comic and or movie, because I am. Not sure if you noticed my avatar I use on Twitch, Darker Manhattan. But uh thanks. But anywho, um We are gonna quit. Thanks, uh Watchman, Saray, Taco for the follows. Thanks, uh, everyone who talked in chat today. We had a lot of chatters today. Thanks, Sympathy, uh, Simply, Shin, uh, Dave for hanging out, uh, Skullweed, uh, thank you, uh, as well for the follow. Appreciate it. I don't need to see that again, no matter how awesome it is. Never seen or anything from it. Oh, okay. Um, anywho, I don't think this will help us at all. Nah, I don't think that'll help us. I'll look into that later, but whatever. Um, anywho, guys, thanks again for joining me. Um, I'll be back later today with some Dark Souls. That'll be fun. Um, gonna eat some food at some point this morning, and it'll be delicious. It'll be inside me, and nourish me and give me health and all that good crap but until then we'll see you down the road thanks again everyone for the new follows and all that stuff uh kagan is here uh hi kagan how are you um <laughs> guys we'll see you uh on the other side um goodbye god i'm hungry goodbye <laughs>